Good morning. I'm in Lakewood, Colorado today, standing right in front of Belmar Park. I was here a couple of weeks ago, did a whole episode walking around the lake here. It's a beautiful lake. And that's, again, what I'm doing today, is going for a walk around the lake. It's about 6.30 in the morning, and it is cold out. Not like Colorado winter cold, but like summer cold, like I did not expect end of July to be this cold. It's cold enough to where I don't see anybody else walking in the park. And what's happened is there's a little bit of cold snap going on up in Evergreen where I was uh, the last week. Last night I think it dropped to uh, not quite freezing. I took a break from walking for the last two days uh, just because of, well, I've had a lot of pain in my left hip. Two days ago I shot a lot of video up in Silverthorne, Colorado, which I never released as one of my vlog episodes, and there was a couple of reasons for that. Reason number one is I don't have an introduction for my YouTube channel. I thought after 250 episodes it was time that I do an introduction for my channel. So I went up to beautiful Silverthorne, up to the lake there, was walking around the lake trying to uh, do this introduction. And I'll show you a, a diagram of the lake. And I walked along this, um, this dam that creates the reservoir. And there was just tons of traffic and, and the lighting was sort of bad. And I was walking continually and couldn't find a place to set down the camera. And I was sort of mumbling because I didn't really write out any sort of plan or script. Which is okay for a normal vlog like this. But... When you're trying to do something that tells like an introduction story, who am I, what is my life? I was all over the place talking about random things and it just didn't make any sense, especially when I thought maybe it was good and I got back and downloaded the video in Starbucks, worked on it for a while and realized that just, it was all random over the all over the place. Shots were not really lined up right and Anyway, it just was not working at all. And the second reason. Well, that's actually what I'm doing now, is trying to do some stretching. I was trying to up the time that I was walking from an hour to an hour and a half. So I walked 45 minutes down the dam around the reservoir to the other side doing pretty well anyway when I started back I was about an hour into it into my walk and my left hip right here started really starting to hurt I just kept having to take breaks and sit down and it was hurting so I made it back after a few breaks but my left hip was really hurting me so I was sort of in pain for the rest of the day and just not really feeling to my best and the video episode sort of the video was just not looking all that awesome so I thought well I can table that I can do that later when I have more time to sort of set up the shots and maybe when I have a day that it's not quite so interesting <laughs> so I can focus on creating the intro video instead of what's happening during my day or maybe there's a way to combine the two so Eventually, I will shoot an introduction to my channel. But it's sort of too bad because Silverthorne was gorgeous. It was absolutely beautiful. Mountains with uh, snow-capped peaks and, and I remember to put my hat on and go find a place to take a nap. It uh, was just beautiful beautiful place up there and I enjoyed my time there didn't necessarily do anything super interesting other than coffee shops and the walk around the reservoir and I was only there for one day so today I'm walking a little bit shorter walking 45 minutes and what I tried to do is what my trainers encouraged me to do and this is what I should have done walking around Silverthorne or all these walks Let's walk about 10 minutes just to get my muscles a little bit warmed up to where they're not super cold and stiff and then do some stretching exercises try to stretch the legs try to stretch the hips so I need to go through and look at my stretching exercises again 
see which ones might help best with this left hip here because that could potentially be an issue. I'm trying to practice walking about four times a week in preparation for the Camino in Spain uh, coming up in September. So that's three weeks of walking, three or four hours a day, about 10, 12 miles a day. So I need to be in shape for that. And if my hip is causing problems, that's not going to be doable. Gonna go to the gym, get some breakfast, and then uh, at noon today, I'm meeting up with my friend Ren again. Had a good workout at Planet Fitness. Got some work done at Starbucks and other videos online. Um, making a quick stop here at my storage unit to pick up a portable grill that I purchased um, several years ago when I lived in Florida. And I've decided to give this to Ren and Carrie. I'm headed over to meet Ren for lunch at 12, so I want to stop past here, pick this up, check out the storage unit, and then over to meet with Ren. What is it with hitting my head on things lately? I just smacked my head on the door on the storage unit. It's sore from yesterday. Um, I've just got to get a hard hat and start wearing it full time. I've arrived at Wren's, but I don't think I can carry the camera and the barbecue grill and my backpack and everything to get up to Wren's apartment. So I'm going to leave the camera here and enjoy some one-on-one -on -one time with Wren and Carrie. Uh, have some lunch, drop off this grill, and then, um, I don't know, then I'll check back in give you guys an update. I had a great time with Ren. We went out to lunch. We went to a place called uh, Grandma's Pies, I think, and it was uh, in southern Denver. And I uh, had pot pie and uh, homemade pie, and it was really a lot of fun. And we spent a little bit of time hanging out. I had some items from Amazon sent to Ren's place, and I have uh, car cameras, uh, my backup camera. So this is a Esky car camera, and I have uh, four units here one which has the lines on it for backing up and the other three are going to be one for the front and one for each of the sides so i have that so that i can start doing some of the electronics i have one other one other item this is a coleman uh, grill and stove so that i'm able to start doing some cooking uh, because right now i don't have any way to cook in the step in I'm going to head over to Becky's house, which you saw at Dinosaur Ridge, and Becky and Christian, and going to hang out with them this evening. I've just arrived at Becky's house, and I'm going to be spending the night here and preparing for her bacon party, which happens tomorrow, an annual event that she started a few years ago, and I've never actually attended one. She started these just after I left the Colorado area. I'm having, I'm having packages delivered all over today. I just came from Ren's house. Packages there, Becky's house, packages here. My eyeglasses just arrived. I just opened up the package and I'm going to try them on. There's a potential here. I haven't even seen these. There's a potential that these could not even fit my face just because I ordered these with the online ordering system. So who knows? This will be a surprise for everyone. Becky insisted that I film this for the opening. So uh, this is from a company called... Zenny and uh, my my niece recommended this and uh, a couple of Are you doing the drum roll? A drum roll. <laughs> We've got Christian over here. He's doing a drum roll for the for the glasses. All right. This is either gonna be spectacular or a major fail. All right. What do you think? I Not can bad. see much better. Excellent. I don't know how they look though. They're alright. Everything's like crystal clear, oh, really? <laughs> really sharp. So right. optically, I like it. Uh, nice. I don't know how it looks on the face. So. I have to go find a mirror. Oh, we just finished dinner at Becky's, and we've been working most of the evening um, doing bacon stuff. I've been cutting bacon. They've been frying up bacon, bacon everywhere. And tomorrow is going to be like. 30 people with just pounds and pounds of bacon and all sorts of recipes. 
Uh, I'm gonna make uh, guacamole bacon dip, which I've never made before, but I got a recipe online and they encouraged me to make that. They thought it was probably about my cooking skill level, which is a whole other story. Um, so I'm gonna be spending the night here at uh, Becky's. They're offering me a bed inside. And uh, then tomorrow we're going to have the bacon party all day long and that should be a lot of fun. So stay tuned for that episode tomorrow. Thank you for watching. Uh, let me know if you hate the glasses, if you like them. I've been wearing them for two or three hours now and I love these things. They're progressive lenses so I can see in the distance on the top. I can see uh, the camera up close in the middle and I can see like right here on the bottom. And the only thing that's a little weird is looking down at the ground while I'm walking. It's all blurry. That's the only thing that's a little awkward. But they're much more comfortable than my other glasses. Again, thank you for watching. Savor the moment. See you next episode.